people aging out of foster care are one of the most often overlooked populations in our community and yet also one of the most at risk. These kids have been bounced around from foster home to foster home and now they're 18 years old and on their own and that's a lot to ask of an 18 year old. It's all about making it easier for the young person to get the services that they need without having to have a big lapse in time. This project is special because it affords us the opportunity to really make a difference in a young person's life. It affords wraparound services. It affords open communication amongst the providers, the collaborative members uh, who are one and the same, and the young person that we serve. We actually get to see that young person from the beginning all the way through to the end. Um, we become their family, we become their extended family, and it means a lot to them. Um, it means a lot to us. This project has changed my life uh, by putting me in my own place, having my own keys, I'm not homeless anymore, I'm not sleeping on nobody's chair, I'm getting ready to go to school, and I'm really excited about it. Services for young people aging out of foster care are disjointed at best. They have to go to one agency for employment help, one agency for housing help, another to get food. It's really complicated, um, especially when you're 19 years old and don't have transportation or know much about how to na navigate all these resources. When we started out, we didn't have a lot of youth involved. Um, and it's grown drastically for kids to be able to receive housing, educational services, employment services. We've seen a lot of better outcomes with our young people. Um, we've been able to keep our young people connected with other resources in the community by, by us collaborating. That makes a difference. That impacts a community. What we need to bring this project to life is, is the support of the community, um, being able to have their support, their buy-in, and to know that these youth that we're serving did not ask to be out there on the streets on their own. Just knowing that they have those resources here in one space is definitely going to make their lives a little easier. Fostering Youth Opportunities is a group of nonprofit and government agencies working together to support young people out of aging out of foster care. For two years, this group of agencies has been working together to support this population, and we're ready to take our work to the next level. We're looking for a collaborative space, what we call a one-stop shop, where what young people aging out of foster care can get all the resources and support they need in one convenient place. We could provide what we call wraparound services for the youth. We work together to identify the needs and best identify what need is most Needed. The Fostering Youth Opportunities has developed this idea of a collaborative space based on our work together over the past two years and what we've heard from our young people. Money from the What Matters grant would go specifically towards helping us build the life skills component of this new space. So independent living goes from A to Z, from how to, to be transitioning to adulthood, from how to wash clothes, how to actually use a computer and write a resume, to interviewing skills, to learning how to cook and clean. Any Anything that you normally would get in a normal home setting, most of these young people are not experiencing that, so we try to make sure that they're ready for the real world um, so they don't have to rely on the system to take care of them. In this collaborative space, not only do our agencies have staff there that can be there for whenever the young people need us, but we'll have real things like a laundry room where they can learn how to do their laundry, a kitchen where they can actually learn how to cook all sorts of things that are necessary skills for our young people to learn. Being able to walk down the hall and talk to somebody is good for the staff, but it's even better for the youth. There's, there's no one else that I can think of that's doing something similar to what we're trying to do. Young people aging out of foster care, it isn't a new phenomenon. Young people have been aging out of foster care for a long time. Around the country, all sorts of things have been tried to help this population. What we're hoping to do, this one-stop shop for young people aging out of foster care, is a unique and new idea. It's something different, and we really truly believe from our two years of working together as a collaborative that it's what these young people want. It's what they've told us that they need to be successful.